Reese Witherspoon's husband, Jim Toth, was arrested for driving under the influence after being stopped by a state trooper in Atlanta for a walk and turn sobriety test. Reese Witherspoon herself was also arrested on a charge of drunk and disorderly conduct after failing repeatedly to remain inside her vehicle. Arrest me? Are you kidding me? I told I'm an American citizen. I am now being arrested and handcuffed? Yep. Do you know my name, sir? Don't need to know. You don't need to know my name? Not quite yet. I'll get oh, that really? information. Okay. You're about to find out who I am. That's fine. I'm not real worried about you, ma'am. My name is Reese Witherspoon. Okay. You're arresting me for obstruction of justice. Mm -hmm. It will be in the national news. I just want to let you know. That's fine. Back in 2007, TV legend David Hasselhoff was caught by his daughter Taylor Ann, lying down drunk and shirtless on a Las Vegas hotel room floor, trying, rather unsuccessfully, to eat a cheeseburger. What? This is a mess. Shia LaBeouf was cuffed and taken into custody in Savannah, Georgia, around 4 a.m. After a stranger refused to give him a cigarette, he became disorderly, using profanities in front of the women and children present, and then attempted to avoid arrest by running to a nearby hotel, where he was caught and charged for public drunkenness, disorderly conduct and obstruction. In 2013, Mark Wahlberg made an appearance on The Graham Norton Show. However, he either drank too much before arriving, or went too hard on the backstage hospitality. Because what started as an entertaining and hilarious episode quickly turned chaotic and then just went downhill from there. Tell us it about 40 minutes ago. Hey, listen, I want to do a I want to challenge you. I want to challenge you to a big dick contest. Interrupt just then. My dad had a had a retail store, a discount women's clothing store called Crazy Sophie's Factory Outlet. It smells so good. <laughs> Johnny Depp seemed a little unstable as he left a fancy gastro pub called 25 Degrees. After signing autographs, his friend tried to help him to his waiting SUV when they both fell down hard to the pavement. Johnny got up and eventually made it to the car, where he flashed a strange salute to the paparazzi, apparently meaning he was okay. Street! There's a public street, okay? Chris appeared on Channel 4's The Last Leg, having apparently skipped dinner and had a few too many leading to a hilarious episode including a story about Kanye West and his dog urinating on Banksy's artwork. I have a theory about trolls. Yes. Which I'd like to share on this platform. Please do. <laughs> which is that this is... You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> <laughs> yes. This is the, 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 the first wave of the apocalypse is this Russian troll horseshit. Chris, it was your birthday this week. Did you stop celebrating? <laughs> I feel like nearer to the end becomes more of a celebration because of all of the reasons you've outlined. <laughs> we went this week, it was my birthday. I don't want everybody to make a big deal out of it. Chris, uh, I used to live in... Uh... <laughs> yep. I used to live in Bermondsey for a long time. Yep. 